What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. If you love dressing up your car, you want to check out this. And that's because I just ordered this. If you've checked out my earlier videos about luxury floor mats, those kind of synthetic leather quilted mats, uh, they dress up the inside of your car. They're pretty, pretty cool. Not for everyone, I get it, but uh, pretty flashy. And so I thought, why not try to see what uh, the accessories that are available to dress up your trunk look like. Now you have seen that I put those luxury floor mats in my Audi and this is basically kind of the same thing but it's just a trunk mat. Now on this side what we have here is like a plastic a little hairy you can kind of feel like the little nibs of plastic kind of sticking out just feels like I don't know, like thin Velcro, almost like a five o'clock shadow. So that'll give you a little traction on the underside. And you can see here, we have this, what do they call it? Like a rolled edge, but piping, but it's in brown. And it's like in the saddle brown. And that is because I ordered this sucker in a kind of, looks kind of like a milk chocolate brown. I really like this color. Now, the thing about this is that I don't have a brown interior in my car, but because of the trunk, I thought, hey, you know what? Screw getting the same color as the rest of my interior. I can get any color I want. I'm an adult. So I got it in this color because I think it really looks nice. And actually, this brown, it's really kind of a nice looking color. It wouldn't be bad, I think, uh, to have it in my entire car. Although, that ain't gonna happen right now. So, uh, I'm gonna put this in there. You can see it's it's basically that PU leather. It's got a little leather texture. This has like almost a gold, I'm sure like a nylon stitching here. You can kind of see how the, they didn't just do an X pattern. They actually have like extra stitching in here. So kind of nice. And then what I did is I actually ordered it based off the model of my car, but I will tell you that the nice people in China that made this for me actually emailed me a couple times to send them one a photo of my trunk as well as measure the dimensions so i don't know that they really actually had the pattern for my car ready to rock they actually kind of built it off my dimensions now i don't know how good my measuring was so i'm really kind of curious to see if this fits so let's give it a try all right so here we are at the back the trunk of my audi a4 it's a b7 I'm just going to open this up and this will be the moment of truth to see if this sucker actually fits or not and what you can see here is actually the trunk is pretty square you know, even these cutouts on the side don't really go to the bottom and uh, this one is covered up by a, a door but then the the edge here is just a little bit curved so i'm really kind of curious to see if this works so i'll put it in here open it up and look at that hide that down there but well looky here that looks pretty good so it's definitely quite a bit brighter than the gray that is your standard like felt colored trunk liner pretty good it could have been a little wider so it's right up against this side on that edge and i probably could have had them make another inch it's probably better to be a little looser than too snug and i've got it pressed all the way up against the back seats there you might be able to see we have oh maybe three quarters of an inch right here too so i could probably have it just a little bit wider now it's really more of a dress-up thing but if you carry stuff that is i don't know damaging dirty and you just want to keep your trunk clean and easier to clean up because this is really easy to wipe down even to close off i've really found them to be pretty tough durable and versatile you can do that and if you want it just to kind of like i said style lies it a little bit like you know you've got stuff like this your tow hook emergency blanket uh shovel umbrella your repair and go bag like all this stuff again now i can kind of bust it around without it damaging the carpet not a big deal but it looks pretty cool and obviously it's easy to peel up so i can get to my spare cool i dig it a little bit of style i know it doesn't match the color i did that on purpose check it out uh this mat here was actually pretty cheap i got it for like 40 bucks so it does take a while because they had to make it and then ship it from overseas but you know compared to the interior set of mats which was a little over a hundred dollars for the whole set you know it's obviously a lot cheaper and you know if you just wanted to experiment with it not necessarily change the whole look of your car this would be a good place to start i'll put a link to it in the description peter Panda out